these guys. So it should be a uh, motivating week for Bryce being back in the mix and obviously going up to Minnesota. How have you seen him respond to being, being sort of back in the mix? Yeah, he's ready. I'm sure he's excited to play. been good they, they go to work the same way every week um, they know they got basically three days left and they get a they get a break so everything we got will be poured into this one Yeah, they, they you know they don't do a whole lot of things they're just good at what they do uh, got some really big guys up front and they've had some Great backs and some answers off the run. So uh, our defense got to be ready to do the best they can against the run and uh, make sure not get hit with anything uh, tricky or new. You guys have been good at hitting the reset button. How has peer leadership played a part in that? Have you seen that sort of start to formulate more like, like you've been hoping it might? Yeah, we got the best leadership we've had. Um, Damien's doing a great job. Austin's doing a great job. Adrian's doing a great job. Deontay. All, you know, all the guys that you would expect are doing a great job and um, keeping everybody in line. Travis Fisher mentioned earlier in the week with Cam Taylor. Maybe early on in the season, he was trying to be that guy who made, you know, those kind of big, big time hero plays. And if you, last week, was that his best game? Have you seen him summer? Yeah, I think it, it was his best game. And you, yeah, football comes to you. You don't go make things happen. Uh, doesn't work that way. You got to be where you're supposed to be, doing what you're supposed to do. And if you're a good player, the, the plays happen. I thought he did a better job of that last week. Similar, I guess. How have you seen Quentin settle in? Obviously, last week. Yeah, Q's been uh, playing well. Um, he is doing what he's supposed to do. You know, people challenged him a lot early on, and uh, he's he's been playing tough and. Um, Coming up and hitting, so he, we, he, he didn't, he wasn't given the black shirt. He earned it, and expect a lot more good games from him. That takes a certain mentality, doesn't it? When you've got a guy like him on the other side, you know they're going to throw at you a lot, like you know, give up a few here and there, just keep that. Yeah, I think they were attacking him more in the run game early in the season than the pass game. He's been doing a good job um, in both phases, uh, but you know what we really wanted to see was him come up and strike, and he's doing a good job of that. Yeah, we got to try to win one on the road. Um, you know, we've had some, um, a lot of away games. Haven't been here much. Look forward to being here more with the fans that we have and the environment right now. Um, the guys are used to being on the road, and we played some good teams on the road. So uh, this is another one and another big challenge. What stood out more about Minnesota's defense the more you guys have studied them this year? Uh, they're just really sound. Um, last couple of years, they've really packed the box and made it really tough on us to to run it. So uh, we got to do a good job coming off the ball and creating things and trying to get things on their secondary. Appreciate it, guys.